um, I kind of, I kind of like woke up one day and you know a teammate was replaced, so I'm not really sure, like how I should like openly say this to the public. So, I think when all when all happened, it was, you know, it was a little kind of like pretty, was pretty quick. You know, it was a little abrupt when all the uh, changes kind of went through. Um, with you know, Poach was a you know was a He's a great teammate. I think there was just a few disconnections happening between his, um, with ideas like mid rounding stuff like that. Oh yeah, I mean, me and Poach are like good friends, so it caught me like surprise um, that he was like gone. You know, Android leaving. You know, he's you know amazing player. He got his you know he got a nice offer from NRG, and I think think he'll do really well there as well. But you know, sometimes change is good. You know, it's not you know the end of the world. You know, we'll have to make it work. With the current players we're lining up and what we're playing with right now, I think we're meshing pretty well, and I think it should be, you know, it should go down the right direction. When I first got here, it was kind of little uh, glum at points, but over time, everyone's been kind of opening up, uh, and that's really what I like seeing in a team, you know? So yeah, taking on the form of IGO for this team has definitely just been a, um, a process, honestly. It's been something that uh, I've been working hard at to make sure I've been getting the best out of it. And really, a lot of it's been just grinding, like putting my time into the team and making sure I've been the best process for the team. So, Reba as a teammate, he brings a lot of positive energy, um, has a really good idea for the game. So he's a very strong IGL. Uh, yeah, I mean, I really respect all his opinions. He's a very, very smart player. Yeah. Uh, Reba brings a kind of a new dynamic with his calling. It's more active in a sense where a lot of the mid-rounding is controlled by him, and a lot of times that throws the enemy team off because they don't really know what we're doing. He, we, we, kind of, we can kind of get into space that normally wouldn't have before. He doesn't necessarily micromanage, but he just he has a good awareness of the game, and I think that brings a lot to the team. We want to make sure our energy is as high as possible because we know for the, a fact that if we're enjoying ourselves and we're playing as best as we can that only comes with making sure everyone is giving a hundred percent to that a lot of teams are not expecting us to do well a lot of teams are not expecting us to really perform to a higher standard that's uh really they're expecting from us and we feel we can still hit that higher standard with kind of the culture we're trying to build here yeah obviously it's going to take um us giving our 100 percent giving the best that we can offer for that but we're we're here to actually show that 